the people are not letting up. Um, they are very clear in their demands. They want this regime gone and they want it to be replaced by democracy and they want the people of Iran to be able to determine their future. I mean, uh, one thing I would like to share is when the Islamic Republic of Iran first came to power in 1979, they didn't immediately make hijab compulsory. It was a very slow, pro it was a very slow process to become what it is today, where women are killed on the street for not wearing their hijab properly. And so the people of Turkey should understand that when you take small steps like this, um, where is the line? Where do you draw the line? And so there needs to be some careful consideration of, of what the people of Turkey want. But I would strongly advise against this kind of move. I think there is inside Iran, there's a sense of unity at the very least to remove this regime. I think regardless of our different beliefs and our different um, ideals and political persuasions, everyone agrees that this regime must go and the time has come for democracy to come to Iran. I that has become absolutely clear in the last 43 years but very clear in the last four months uh, is that this regime cannot be reformed. There is no steps that this regime can take which would make it acceptable to the people of Iran and, frankly, acceptable to the world. This is different. This is genuinely a revolution and people want change. And I can at the very least speak for the people of Kurdistan and say that there is no turning back.